and you're still watching TVC News. Now, for years, the campaign for a clean environment has been the subject of global concern. But in Lagos, a local food market got a taste of the message to keep their stalls clean and avoid throwing waste into the lagoon. Sarah Yeku joined the Lagos State Water Authority, top government functionaries, and the entourage of celebrities who helped dramatize the message. Not a typical day at the Okiari market on Lagos Island. As visitors move busily around, it's a moment traders also have high-profile guests in their midst with a message now resounding around the world. It's time up for indiscriminate waste disposal. The Lagos State Waterways Authority hopes to protect the coastal lands, sensitize residents of Lagos to proper waste disposal and conduct research that will help policy formulation. They have brought their campaign to markets where sections are marked by dirt. Where Representing the governor of Lagos State, the Commissioner for Transport, points to the dangers of letting more waste accumulate in the lagoon. It says it's rather unfortunate that the Lagos Lagoon battles environmental degradation, especially with the route expansion and additional ferries and jetties. The Lagos State government saw the need to embark on this massive cleanup campaign as a way to sensitize all the relevant stakeholders along the coastline to stop fault waste, any form of pollution, waste disposal, or any other form of abuse. Waterways. This waterways cleanup campaign is described as a milestone event, but this is not the first time this cleanup exercise has been organized. So why put up another? Processes and exercises have not really had maximum impact because there was not that collapse. <laughs>